finally able to explore this beautiful island alone. Tayo papasok sa cave na to. Nalagyan um, na namin ng towel para um, hindi na tayo magasgas. Kuya Benji! Ayan. Ikasawa tayo, Kuya Benji! inside so this is inner part of the yeah Hi everyone. So I'm with Miss Yazi. Yeah. So ayun, so habang papanik kami sa taas, na nakita po kaming ibon, yung hooded pita. So luckily, nakuha na ni Ma'am Yazi. Sobrang rare na makita yeah. ko. So napakahirap. Colors, no? Yes po. Pakita natin. Ayan. Kita ba? Mamay I'll post it. Ayan. So inakit namin to sa mula dun sa baba. Ayan po. Nang sobrang tahimik para mahabol yung ibon na yun. Go now! Yay! At least ako ba? Nice. One more thing I always say kapag ka nagtitravel sa forest is say thank you to the universe, say thank you to nature. So, salamat po. At sobrang Pinoy at lagi kong ginagawa. Lagi ako nagtatabi-tabi po. Kahit saan man magpunta kong taping, kahit anumang forest, kahit anumang uh, pag-hike o bundok. Wala, nagigustrata pa lang yung environment and everything that lives in it. And we made it. We made it tayo siya. We will not hike. And we will not hike. And dito sa site na to, may wedding na magagalap. Walang tao dito. So peaceful. And pagkatapos na lahat ng mga activities, snorkeling, magsilip sa mga cave. Now it's time for lunch. A fish, rice, and sita. Lunch time. This experience made me learn so much. 
not only about the place and the beautiful islands of Anita Palawan, but also about myself. I had so much time to reflect, to appreciate, to pray and be grateful, and think about how to take care of myself even more. And of course, to take care of the environment.